Get the brand new limited edition Pals Holiday Package available at thepalsmerch.com. Oh, what is this? I'm sorry, chicken. I'm sorry. I don't trust you. You're a spy. The chickens are working with the zombies. It's actually quite disturbing. How we doing, fellas? Welcome back to another Minecraft video, another Palscraft episode. This is episode 9 in the series. If you guys are liking this series so far, let me know down in the comments below because I like that positive feedback. I'm trying to bring you guys what you want. If you don't want this, let me know. But I'm pretty sure you do, so I'm gonna keep doing it because Minecraft's fun. You got a problem with Minecraft? You got a problem with me. So don't double cross me or Minecraft because you'll get the... You'll get the karate chops real quick. All right, so last time we left off, we did something terrible. And by we, I mean me, because it was my fault. Okay, I did it. I will own up to it. This is not the first TNT-related incident that has happened with me on Palscraft, okay? I, for some reason, keep finding myself in situations where I'm blowing up things I don't want to blow up. <laughs> Why? Why do I do this? I don't know. What I'm talking about is last time we blew up Coral's base by accident. The entire thing. Gone. But I didn't place the TNT again, right? I know. It's like the first time Coral placed TNT in the pal's clubhouse, and I blew it up. And the second time, Jay, the mysterious not-a-pal person, placed TNT all over Coral's base, and I accidentally set it off. It's okay, though. What I did is I left a little box of items near Coral's base. All my good stuff. It was a stack of 29 diamonds and three stacks of iron. I almost did four. Three. <laughs> three stacks of iron. Now, as far as I know, Coral has not taken that out of the chest yet. It's still there, and I want to check up on that just to make sure no one stole it, which we will get into later in the video. On top of the fact that I gave Coral all my good stuff, I told him it was okay for him to move in with me. I don't know when that's gonna happen. I know that was what we were trying to prevent. We were trying to scare him, just to have him stay away from my base by leaving a trap, and then we blew up his entire base. We felt bad, and we gave him all our stuff, the exact thing that we didn't want to give him, and now we're letting him live with us? Another thing we didn't want to have happen, but it's okay, because we have an even bigger enemy right now. Who is the person that has been trying to get me to attack Alex when my real enemy was Coral? Who is the person who put all the TNT in Coral's base? Who is the person who has infiltrated the PAL server? It's Jay, okay? Jay is the real enemy here. Me and Coral have a common enemy now. If you guys remember from last episode as well, Jay also threatened to blow up our base if we didn't kill Alex and break the blood bond. But now that me and Coral have put our differences aside and we no longer need Jay to destroy Coral, we can now finally be free and we can go after this Jay guy, whoever he is. So guys, if you have any information on Jay, please leave it down in the comments. I would love to know about that. In today's episode, what I wanna do is I wanna enchant some of my armor. I only have three levels, unfortunately. I'm working on trying to get a mob spawner so that I can make an EXP farm so that experience points will never be a problem for us. We can just always get EXP whenever we want. I have to build a lot of stuff in order to do that. It's like it's super long and complicated unless I can get a diamond pick with silk touch on it. If it's silk touch then we're good, I can do that. And I can just mine the spawner and that'll be all good and taken care of. But if I can't get a pick with silk touch, then we're gonna have to do it the old fashioned way. And that's like building these super, super complicated machines. I've started to build them and I'll show you what I'm talking about in a second after I mine open this brick right here. Yes, break open. Also, don't tell Coral this is here. This is my private stuff. Anyway, we need this machine frame and this lead stone and what else? What else? We need like a machine chassis right here. Two machine chassis. We need these things too. I don't even know what they do. They just kind of like hold stuff. I'm pretty sure you have to put lava in there. We have to make this this thing called invar ingots. It's really complicated. That's why I don't want to get into it in the actual videos. I'm gonna do that outside the videos because it's so long and it, explaining it would just take forever. So what I want to do is I want to do some little housekeeping. I want to go, I want to check on the farm, I want to check on the cows that I've been trying to grow in here. Oh yes, you guys are looking great, all big and grown and strong. Love you. I'm just gonna keep breeding cows until I have like a billion cows to where they can't move and then I'll have an endless food supply so we'll be good after that. <laughs> so we got 15 wheat. It's gonna drive those boys crazy. Come here, boys. I have I have what you want. I have what you're looking for. Oh, yeah. You like that? You guys like that, don't you? Yeah, yeah, that's right. Now stay in here. 
<laughs> Alright, so we checked that farm. We also have to check down here. Oh, I also forgot to tell you guys I got some more carts. I got some more tracks and I got some iron mine carts. So that's pretty cool. I don't think we're gonna get into making the mine cart in this episode because I need powered tracks to be able to do that. So we're gonna do that later some other time. We gotta collect all this sugar cane. Oh yeah, baby looking good. I'm gonna put this in my farming chest real quick. Grab some bread because I've already made a bunch of bread. I came prepared for you guys right here look at that look how much bread i got i'm gonna make a new chest plate and new boots i'm gonna leave this stuff in here for now because i want fresh stuff we're going on an adventure today we're going on an adventure and what i want to do is i want to go to a temple because i found a temple that would be really cool to check out with you guys and i also want to go to the why do i always forget the name the twilight forest we're going to the twilight forest today uh i don't know what we're gonna do in the twilight forest we're just gonna figure it out as we go along because that's the exciting part of pals craft never know what's gonna happen so before we go i just want to enchant some things i used a lot of the scrolls that i had in here and the only three i have left are three that i've already learned so i'll save those if coral wants to learn them or something i don't know he's probably gonna end up using this place as his home too because you know totally my fault i destroyed everything i'll leave them in there for him and i just want to enchant some things but we'll throw that in there what no do i have to take away bookcases if i want to get like less levels or do i just not have enough come on oh there we go there we go we got three protection one perfect all right i used all my experience unfortunately i don't have any other experience i can use to enchant things but it's okay because i have an enchanted sword still i don't know if i showed you this but i have bane of anthropods that means i kill spiders like nobody's business and then i also have an enchanted pick with unbreaking one which is great because it's gonna last me a very long time shut up in there cowies Ooh, experience. Give me that. Give me that. Now I have one level. Good. Hopefully, by the time I get back from my adventures, we can enchant some more things. Hopefully, I have enough armor by then. But as you guys can see, this skull and crossbones is 600 meters away. It's super far. That is the Mayan temple that I've discovered just off recording. So I'm going to walk all the way there. And I'll come back to you guys when we make it. Cowie, get over here. You're dead. Give me that. Give me all this stuff you got. You got leather. Nice. You got some raw beef. I'll make a sandwich. Look at it. Two pieces of bread. We got a sideways sandwich right there. Ready to go. Yum, yum. And this temple is right over this hill. Right here. We are ready to explore. See what's inside. Hopefully there's something cool in there, dude. There better be something cool. If I walked all this way for no reason, your boy's gonna be upset. Oh, baby, I hear some spiders in there. Good thing I brought my enchanted sword, because I'm ready to slice these spiders up real good, like. This is like a dungeon? This is crazy. Hold on, I gotta get my torches out. I should have brought more torches. I, w I did not come prepared. They could be anywhere. They could be around any corner. What? Is this like a maze? Oh, no, dude. Hopefully we can just, like, mine through part of this. I don't want to get stuck in a maze, dude. Oh, it looks like I'm already lost. Where am I going? Where did I come in? Right there. That's where I came in. Where is this place? Oh, right here. Okay, I found it. I found it. We're good. What the heck is going on in here? Where are... Oh! Oh, oh, no. Bad spider. Bad... Oh! Oh! Stop it. Stop it, zombie. Stop it, zombie. Is this where all the monsters are? I'm just gonna keep swinging. Oh, there you guys are. Ow! Are there two spawners in here? Like, what's going on? Ow! You guys need to knock it off. Like, this is not fun. This is not fair to me. Look how easily I kill spiders. I kill them in one hit, dude. Oh, there is a spawner in there. Hold on, hold on. Get out of here. Get out of here. Get out of here. Break these up real quick. Hmm. Should I keep this spawner here? Oh, what? That one has a hat. Hold on. That one has a hat. Hold on. We gotta... Put some torches around here so they don't spawn. Hey, present zombie, you get out of here. Regular zombie, you get out of here too. Oh, I got some chain mail. Ah, baby zombie, get out of here. Is it over here somewhere? Is it over? There it is. No, wait, right here. Right, right. Ow, ow. No, you died. We found the zombie. There's two. There's two zombie spawners. That's crazy. Are the spiders still spawning? Are there more? They might just be spawning just in the darkness because I don't have enough torches to light up this place. Why didn't I bring more torches? I don't know. It was a dumb thing to do. I should have. I should have brought more. I should have came prepared. You guys know me. Scoopy never comes prepared ever. Ever. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Get out of here. There must be lower layers to this place. I mean, I'm going to break these because it gives me a lot of experience. So I'm just going to keep going deeper into the temple because, you know, why not? Break these. Give me all those. Give me all those. Yeah. Where are the rest of the zombies? Oh, down here. This is where you're coming from. You think you're slick, spiders. You think you're slick down there, but you're not. Ah! Hey, the zombies came in for a visit. How are you guys? There's so many mobs. If I jump down there, I feel like I'm gonna die. So I don't want to do that. Ah! Look at how many there are. You guys are ridiculous. You guys really. Ow! Stop it. 
Hold on, I need to break this sooner. There we go. All right, I need to make some room down there. I'm coming down in a second. I just need to kill all you guys first. Look at the zombies are still pouring in. Oh my goodness, there's so many. Why are there so many? Ah! Oh no. Oh no, what have I done? It's okay. It's okay, it's okay, it's okay. I'm gonna kill these guys real quick. Uh-oh, more zombies are coming. Break that, break that, break that, break that real quick. Okay, I killed these zombies. Oh no, here they come. Stop it. You die. You die, zombie. This place is insane, dude. Hey! Get out of here. Why was he riding a chicken? Hold on, I need to heal up. Can we take a timeout? Hey, I said timeout, man. I need to take a break. Hold on. Ow. Stop it. I'll kill you in one hit. You know that. All right, I'm gonna clog this up real quick. Go in here. Hey, you die. You die. Chop this down. There are so many spawners here. Like, I am so surprised. I did not expect this at all. This is definitely the coolest dungeon I've been in, in Pals Craft so far. Like, this is sick. I want to do more stuff like this. So there's zombies coming from this way, so we should probably go that way and check it out. I hear you, zombies. I hear you. Where are they coming from, though? They have to be around here somewhere. There must be a spawner or something. There's still so, so many mobs. What the heck? Where did you come from? Where are you guys coming from? Is there another spawner in there? Ow! No, stop it. Let's get over there. Break that real quick. Ah, there we go. We got another spider spawner in the bag. Tag him and bag him, boys. Tag him and bag him. I should eat some food really quick. There we go. There we go. Get some more hearts. Get some more hearts up in there. You die. You die. You die. You die. There are definitely spawners lower that I haven't been to yet. Ow. What the heck? You guys stay down there. I'm not ready to deal with y'all yet. You're being mean. Where the spawners at? Ow. Oh, no. Oh, no, 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 no. You stay back there. You stay back. You stay back. You stay back. You stay back. I should have brought more torches, dude. I, I did not come prepared. Ah. Stop. Stop, 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 stop. I need to heal up real quick. There you go. I'm safe over here. I'm pretty sure. Pretty sure I'm safe. I need to wait for my hearts to get back up, dude, because this is dangerous. I don't want to die out here. I have four broken cave spider spawners. I have two new scrolls that I can learn. I can learn. I'm going to learn them right now. I don't want to lose these guys and not be able to do it later, so... Might as well get this achievement. We got Fiery Core. And we also got Knockback. This is a great enchantment. Can you enchant things multiple times? I think you can. All right, I got my some of my health back. I'm going in. I'm going in. I'm going in. Get these zombies. Ow! There they are. They're right. They're coming from the right side. Get out of here. No, don't hit me. That's very bad. It's very mean of you. You don't do that to people. Oh, that one has armor. This one's going to be difficult. It's a boss battle. Come on, torches. Get in here. That's why there's so many zombies. Because whenever you get zombie spawners, there's always two of them right next to each other which is absolutely ridiculous and there's two more in here there's four all together that's too many that's too many spawners good lord no 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 i'm not ready i'm not ready break that break that break that oh oh two spawned in just in time for my finishing move all right all right there's more zombies this way apparently are the zombies this way oh we're going deeper fantastic hold on let me eat some food real quick before we go there we go there we go oh what is this I'm sorry, chicken. I'm sorry. I don't trust you. You're a spy. The chickens are working with the zombies. It's actually quite disturbing. All right, this is just a maze, dude. Ah! No, spider, you get out of here. Is there a spawner in here? Oh, they're coming from below again? Oh, jeez. Okay, hold on. Gotta wait right here. Hopefully, there's none behind us. There probably is, though. Okay, keep going. Keep going. Where are the zo- Okay, spiders are this way. Spiders are this way. Where are the spawners at? Show me where they at. Where they be- there, there, they're this way. This is a maze, man. How the heck am I supposed to figure this out? So stressful. I wonder what's at the bottom. There has to be something cool at the bottom, dude. It has to be this way. I knew it. I knew it has to be over here. Ah! Uh, hello, spiders. Is this where you originate from? Yes, right here. All right, we'll claim this. So many, so many spawners. I did not expect to be getting this many spawners today. Like, this is bananas. Oh, let's break these real quick. What? That one has a st armor on in there. What? That's crazy. This zombie must have come from somewhere else. There has to be more spawners on this level over here. Oh, jeez. There's a bunch of them. Oh, no. They're coming from upstairs. They're coming from this way. All over the place, dude. Hey, get out of here. Oh, I hope I don't get cornered. That would be terrible. Where are they coming from? Where are they? What? Which way is up? Which way leads me to the spawners? I don't understand. Oh, wait. This one right here. Oh, dude. I only have one torch left. That is not okay. That is not okay. We're gonna have to just rough it. It's over here. What is this? Why is it so light over here? For no reason. That this is a safe area? Maybe? I don't know. I don't know, man. Dude, I don't even know if we're gonna be able to go to the Twilight Forest today. This is, this is a deep 
dungeon and I need to find out what's at the end of it, dude. I have a stack of 64 strength. Nobody should ever have that much strength. That's ridiculous. That's so, so ridiculous. Are there more? Are there more spawners around here? There must be. There are lower levels than this, guys. Trust me, I know. From experience. From experience, I know. I hear the zombies this way. Where are you, zombies? Just follow the groans. You follow the groans. You will be led to the spawner. What the heck? There's just a spider here for no reason. I'm just gonna mine towards spiders. I hear you. There you are. Ah, oh, yes. We got that spawner. Oh, there's more this way. There's definitely more this way. Hello. Hello. Welcome to my house. This is my house now. I'm going to break your spawner. Yay. There must be more. I need that torch back, actually. I only have two, two torches left. I'm doing pretty good with my torch management. I'm pretty impressed with myself. Oh, hello. I was looking for you. I heard you snooping around somewhere, zombie. I done heard you. Silly boy. Silly, silly boy. Uh-oh. 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 Where'd you come from? There's no spawner in here. Hmm. There should be a spider right under me, right? If I go down. Oh, wait. Is this the end? I think this is the end of the temple. I think I I made it to the very bottom. I think I might have missed some. Oh, wait, no. Huh. What? I will envision the shacks. So pleasant. Okay, so we got some books to read. We got some gold. And we also got some bones. Some cobweb. We can make cobweb, but we haven't gotten any. We just got a bunch of string so far. I'm gonna be honest, this is a pretty garbage reward for the effort that it took to get all this stuff. Or to get this far, I should say. Dang, that's some butt. Unless I missed some chests, which I probably did. I probably did miss some things probably wasn't paying attention gotta go back gotta go kill the rest of the monsters that live inside this terrible place i'm coming to get ya all right i can't i don't remember which way is up i don't remember how to get back upstairs i'm just gonna start mining mining upwards yeah that's right Ooh, okay we just mined through a stairwell so that's good maybe i don't know oh hey was i just here i think i was just here nope i wasn't what the heck this place is such a maze and i don't mean it's amazing i mean i'm literally lost i don't know where i'm going oh spiders in the ceiling what the heck? Where did they come from? I hear more spiders this way. You're very annoying. Did you know that? Ah, that one has a hat. <laughs> what the heck? Oh, hello there. There must be a spawner over there that I missed. I must have missed it. Hold on. Let's place some place some bricks so I can get over there. Ah, oh, what? No, there's no, there's no hallway over there. How did they get there? I know there's like one more spawner that I missed. I hear the spiders. There you are. I knew you were somewhere, guys. I heard you. How, see, what is this? I, I've never been to this part, I don't think. Keep on looking. Maybe it's just leftover spiders that are spawning in the dark. There might not be any more spawners, which I'd be very disappointed if there wasn't. But you know what? Let's just get out of here. Oh, what? There's another hallway over here. I found the main stairwell up. So let's go. My camera died. I'm sorry for those of you wanting to see my beautiful face. I have to get out of this place. Oh, okay. We're making some progress. We're making some progress. I This was a spawner room. Go mine out of here. We did it. We made it out. Oh, sweet, sweet air. Fresh air. Oh, there they are. I knew you guys were hiding somewhere. <laughs> silly, silly spiders. Anyway, I'm gonna go back to base. I'm gonna put all my stuff away and then I will resume and we'll do some more cool stuff. So we made it back to the base. I put all my stuff away, but I still have all of these levels, 35 levels. That is a lot. But the thing is, I don't know if I should use these levels to enchant iron armor because look, the chest piece that I just made, protection one, it did me really well during that adventure, but the durability is almost halfway gone. So what I wanna do is I wanna make diamond armor. But as you guys remember, I gave all my diamonds to Coral because I blew up his base because I felt bad. But the thing is, Maybe we should go and take some of those diamonds back because I don't know about you guys, but does Coral really deserve all those diamonds? I don't think so. I mean, yes, we destroyed his house. He had a lot of valuables in there and we did our best to replace those valuables, but he also did mess with us in the first Palscraft episode on the main channel. And he's been kind of a jerk to us ever since trying to live inside our base without asking us. I'm gonna go take some of that back. Maybe I was being a little bit too generous with my uh, my valuables, I'm not sure. But let's go back and see what's going on there. All right, guys, we're almost back to the tree. We're actually here. I didn't see the tree because the entire bottom half of it is gone. Uh, get out of here, zombie. I don't have time to mess with you right now. So this is the signs I left and my stuff should be... What? What? Okay, so I'm positive Coral didn't take the stuff out of that chest yet because he would have told me. He definitely would have said something. What? I don't understand. Who took- Who took the- Who just takes stuff? Who just takes diamonds out of a chest that's not yours? Clearly, these signs- Skeleton, can you stop? I'm really- I'm just going through a lot right now. Can you stop? Can you stop? Can you stop? 
I hate skeletons. They're so annoying to fight. Are you serious? And now there's a zombie on a horse trying to kill me. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, horsey. I don't want to kill you. Come on. Don't make me do this. I, I did it. I killed him. And now there's a baby zombie after me. Come on. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. Please. Clearly, whoever took this stuff just completely disregarded the fact that these were for somebody else. That, that was all my stuff. Come on, dude. That, that's not fair. So now we have to go to everybody else's base and see who it was. You know, it could be Alex. It could be Alex for payback from when I set those traps up at his base. If he found out, that would definitely be reason to steal them. It could be Sub, but at the same time, I don't think Sub would do that because he just recently posted a video where he made an automatic mining machine. So why would he want to steal? Steal people's stuff if he has a machine that automatically mines for him. He can just get ore and diamonds and stuff whenever he wants. Automatically, without even being around. Where's Alex's base? Alex's base is th that spawn point. Where is it? It's over this way. Yellow. I'll meet back up with you guys after I'm at Alex's base. Alright guys, I'm almost at Alex's base. Now we have to check to see if he has like a hidden chest anywhere. Because if he has any hidden chests, most likely he put his valuables in the hidden chest. Like I don't think he would put anything super, super valuable out here. Ooh, what? Can we make sticky pistons with this? I really need some sticky pistons for my door. I think I'm, I'm going to take two of these just in case. I'm sure he won't miss them. I'll leave everything else though. I'm not here to steal things, guys. I don't want to steal from people. That's not what I'm about. All right, I'm here to get my stuff back. No, no, no. That's definitely not my stuff. That's not my stuff. That's not my stuff. It has to be around here somewhere. I don't think Alex, Alex hasn't even set off that trap yet, so I can't I can't set that off. That would be setting off two traps that I placed by accident. Let's see. Maybe he put it in the wall or something. In the wall, no. No, what? This is stone. Obviously, if he had it right there, maybe it's under this. Maybe it's down below. Maybe it's a hidden chest down here. Maybe. I don't know. Is, did he cover this all back up? No, he couldn't have. I know there's a base down here. Aha, we found it. Okay, so um yeah not here definitely not here crap who else who else could have taken this i don't understand who would benefit from just stealing from core like i mean i mean anybody would benefit just from stealing like anybody's ore but like come on that was my stuff like you didn't have the right to take that come on oh excuse you excuse you creeper oh all right that i'm just gonna leave that there that's not me that has nothing to do with me all right so Alex doesn't have it. As far as I can see, Alex doesn't have it. I don't think that he would have like a random chest. I don't know, maybe under the dirt or something. Any random blocks? Why is there a torch over here? Is there something important over here, huh? Huh, something important? Right there? Hmm, maybe right here? Right, right there? Nope, maybe right there? Maybe right here? Maybe right there? Ow! Okay, that, that really hurt. Nope, okay. Alex didn't do it. We've come to that conclusion. All right, guys, so we checked Alex's base. It's not there, so I am pretty positive that Dennis took all that stuff, which is rightfully mine, which I'm going to obviously give some to Coral, but I don't know why I gave, like, I literally gave away everything I had, and I don't know why I did that. It's okay, like, in the long run, I know that I'm gonna find more diamonds in the future. I'm not too worried about that, but why would Dennis steal something from Coral? He must have known that I was the one that blew it up. I'm the stupidest pal there is like of course i was the one to blow it up alex is too competent sub is a genius he's obviously not gonna blow something up by accident cora wouldn't blow up his own base and dennis didn't do it so like come on you you guys it's me obviously it was me but anyway i'm gonna go back to my base real quick i'm gonna see if i can make anything with the diamonds i have left over because i really don't have that many diamonds i think i have like five he just said no you're not yes i yes yes Yes, I am. Yes, I am. Okay, he left the game. Whatever. I'm gonna get back to my house, and then we shall enchant some things if we can. I want to try to make some armor. Hopefully, we have enough to make at least one piece of armor, but I'll see you when we get there. All right, guys. We made it back to the base just in time for, uh, I don't know, probably... I don't, I don't know where I was going with that. Anyway, we're gonna go make some diamond armor, hopefully. At least, like, one piece. I, I pray we have enough for the chest piece, but honestly, I don't think we're gonna have enough. I think I'm gonna have to stick to making, like, a helmet or maybe pants or boots. Oh, I forgot to put that down. Dude, what if Coral wandered into my base and he just saw a hole in the ground and saw all my valuable stuff? What? I have 13. Whoa, I thought I had way less than that. Okay, we definitely have enough. Oh, yes, I remember. I went mining the other day. I'm stupid. Okay, all right, so we got 
the chest piece that's good i'm gonna just stick with that for now i'm gonna put the rest of my diamonds back because i don't want to be diamondless you know i want to have at least a little bit of diamonds lying around if i need them if like for an emergency or whatever so i'm gonna put those back there we have this diamond chest piece that we can enchant and let's do it i don't want to do like a super high enchantment because honestly it's like it's a gamble I, it, like it, it's not necessarily going to give you something crazy good so we're gonna do 12 sure why not <gasps> unbreaking fire protection thorns i don't know what that does but wow does it sound good now, why did i do that i should have made something else and now i have two enchanted ch chest pieces i can't use two enchanted chest pieces whatever this one's way better Better. anyway i'm gonna use this for now thank you guys so much for watching i hope you enjoyed watching as much as i did playing if you guys want to see more pals craft on the channel let me know down in the comments like the video and subscribe it really helps me out a lot but as always i'll see you guys in the next video take it easy